Like, JFK is just going to stand up and, like, knock out Ashura. Yeah. And is this going to be a preview of the Money Match? Who knows? What do you think? What do you think? I think so. I think this could be it. This could be it. That or unless they do a Money Match and they just troll. Yeah, that, I would. I don't know. Would you troll if money was on the line? Depends. Nah. <laughs> I challenged I challenged a bad wolf to a money match, but instead of actually betting money, I betted I bet a hug. That's he didn't accept. That's unfortunate. Might have to go call him out in front of everyone. I'd money match him in, in PM or melee. And I, would I just did. Like He's the one who got me into Smash, and he oh, he yeah. runs these tournaments at his house every once in a while. Oh, cool. First one I went to, he money matched a guy, and the guy got so intense he like threw his controller against the wall and it broke. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Yeah. Then we were doing crew battles, and this was when I was a button spammer and like had no clue what I was doing. And I was up against Bad Wolf, and he was like, "Just take one stock. I don't care if you win, just one stock." I didn't take any stocks, and he just raged and like punched the wall. Way to go! So, so word to the wise: don't get that intense. All right. So we're seeing the Pit DDD combo come out. This is interesting. They've been running a lot of Falco DDD. I know that much, and. Uh, I know that they also went to the Mario Lucina team. Looks like they're gonna give this a try. I think uh, he should be interesting. Escher's also obviously very well known for his pit, his Falco, and his Lucina. But we've seen some diversity come out from Vag recently, which is nice. He's not just repping the DDD, he's also repping the Mario. So we'll see what happens here. Expanding his range of characters. Yeah, always a good thing to do. Oh, of course. It's nice to have options for different matchups. Especially if you are strong with all of them, yes. rather than just like a few and then you're like meh at some of them. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so there's a lot of deliberation going on right now between Vege and Etura, thinking about what they're going to play on. I think this is going to be rough for JFK and Gay in the long run. Um, I, I, I don't think that Escher and Berg are going to be susceptible to losing a longer set. And even if they do get a reset, which would be very great to see, I still think this is yeah, somewhat agree. favored on Escher and Meg. I would definitely but, I mean, agree. These, I mean, the, at the end of the day, these are the number one and two seeds. So this is... This is the one thing that I think helps a lot last night at for glory uh gay and jfk were here and they were in grand finals i think don't quote me on that and then Ashur and veg i think veg was here i don't think Ashur was here so getting that extra experience right before fisticuffs yeah. could help yeah. just we'll see we'll see what happens but here we go grand finals of smash four doubles here at fisticuffs located all that in the bag of chips in Aurora, Colorado. I'm out. I, know. Get some yeah. food. I, I don't know. I don't. I don't like that strategy from Gay. I mean, I understand that he's sort of the support of the team, so he does tend to like lay back and try and keep his stocks and try and keep his percent low. And but then, sometimes he kind of leaves JFK on his own. I don't, I don't know. Yeah, they they'll focus JFK and yeah. then he'll just kind of stand back yep. and wait to support. I think the key to uh, to fighting is fighting this uh, DDD pit team is to either A, chase after Meg when he goes up in the air together so that he has less options as like a coverage because you know, he can come down with so many different elevating moves. He can cover a lot of space in the air. You either do that or you let DDD do that and then you double team after that. And it seems like right now they're trying to focus a lot on Meg. Yeah, get other things. It looks like... Um, Veg and Ashura are trying to focus on JFK, and the other ones are focusing on Veg. Veg is his first off unfortunate right there. Here we go. Ooh, the back air. The bonus back air. Oh, JFK doesn't follow up on Veg. Instead tries to go for an edge guard on Ashura and doesn't get it. This is looking really precarious for Green Team right now. Good punishment on the uh, on the landing there from Ezra. Here we go. Let's see if DD needs to Good punish right. by Gay. Yeah. Still though, this is just what Gay does on this team. He just he keeps up he keeps himself alive. 
we saw earlier against the, uh, the double cannons, he didn't lose his third stock until they were both on their last stock. So I'm pretty sure just a second ago as well, um, Gay just got saved by the DDD yeah. as he hit him up from the top. I really like that decision there to keep on pummeling Meg so that they were both locked up. That's the up smash for the kill. Another and their side is out. finally going to take out Gay's stock. But they are at a stock deficit right now. RTHC. Let's see if they can make a comeback right here. I think they should just keep on focusing on JFK. Even if Gay is covering JFK very well and his stock can't be extremely well, can't really focus on the stock. Ooh, nice forward smash there. But uh, that looks like he's on his last limb here. Ooh, the up smash. He's gonna team kill and not and get there. There goes. This is a rough first He takes the stock. Ooh, he takes the stock. All right, here we go. Two stocks to four right now. Really rough for the green team. All right. So again, there's your off stage. This is really rough. And turns oh, it around on him and keeps oh, it. Almost. Stays alive. Yeah. Almost gets a really quick turn around there, but the side will take that one. Oh no. The, the team kill. Yeah, he tried to save his. Uh, <laughs> the egg. Yeah, he tried to save his uh, teammate. Ended up taking him out. Now, I think the. Uh, I think this is going to be it. Yeah, unless, unless he goes beast I mode, don't, M2K. I don't but think. No, no, I don't I'm, think that. Uh, I don't think that DDD is the character to do that. No, not at all. Just can't. Oof. Especially down off. by two stock. Yeah. Ooh! Oh. The, f the giant head of Yoshi. That big fair coming down. He's gonna take that game one. JFK and Gay coming out the gate really strong. Mishra and Beg, they're gonna have to figure out. Do we know who knocked out Gay and JFK? I do the believe loser. it was uh, Andu and Sunny. Okay. That's correct, yeah. It was Andu and Sunny who put. And Ashura and Beg beat Andu and Sunny, so. Yep. Right see now. if they. What they yeah, choose. I think they have to make an adjustment here, realizing that Beg was focused very hard during that game. And they're going to have to move some things around. Change up their targeting, think about their positioning a little bit more. You Where see um, JFK and Gay. Conversing about what they're gonna do, yeah. and it looks like a sure and bag are just kind of getting yeah. in the zone. Yeah, I think the, the thing is, is that if if Gay can successfully cover JFK, then generally speaking, they'll win. But what what ends up happening sometimes, I noticed in other matches, is that sometimes Gay will not effectively cover JFK, and JFK will just get focused, and it won't matter that you know he has more stocks. At the end of the day, you know, it's like he's playing 2v1 all the time. Yeah. And that, that can be really rough. And I've seen the same thing happen with Veg, Veg, sorry. Veg sometimes will try and sort of stay above the action so that he can cover options coming down. The problem with that is that a lot of the time, Eshira is also left on his own up against Gay and then they're at the 2v1, they don't, that last match, they weren't working in tandem yeah, together. Exactly. With a wombo combo or anything like that, it was just a, I'm going to do stuff, you do stuff, hopefully we don't die. But uh, we're going to see a Falco and a Mario, so they're going to try the character change. I like this because Gay and JFK are coming from the loser side of this Grand Finals, so they are going to have to reset the bracket if they want to take it. So trying out different characters, I totally respect this. Not off to a great start, though. Getting a lot of free percent for a bad grab from Metro. Falco against Yoshi is pretty rough. Falco cannot keep up. And, oh, no. No, no, no. Almost, okay, almost right. lost. Don't worry. Yeah. Yeah, it's very hard for Falco to keep up with Yoshi. Yoshi has really great frame data. Very, very fast. Yeah, this is not looking good for THC. JFK beasting on Zeg to take that first stop. Alright, here we go. Sorry guys, there's a lot of hype going on around about these squads A lot squads of hype right for now. squads. Squad hype is everywhere. So hard to do. Ooh, nice up smash though. Good punish. Mario's up smash so strong. 
bunch of invisibility on it as well. Oh, the oh, follow up on go. the up air. So nice there. From so already down two stock. Yeah. This is still pretty close if they can steal this out. But Beg is eating all kinds of damage from JFK. Already at 70%. Looking pretty rough. Shoutouts to Arizona, by the way. Ooh. That was a great save from JFK. And will Yoshi? Yep, Yoshi. Yeah, he always, he always makes it back in this game. <laughs> JFK Ooh, knows how to deal yeah. with recoveries. Yeah. One thing that a lot of people don't know about Yoshi... Ooh, Ooh. beautiful forward smash. Yoshi is extraordinarily heavy. Um, it's incredible. His, his character's weight is very high, and a lot of people don't expect that. But he, uh... He's one of the heavier characters in the game. Oh, that down there is so much damage. So that was a good combo. Yeah, Gay tried to follow it up, didn't quite get it. Still, though, Vegan a really tough spot on his second stop. Gay, once again, proving that he is one of the best supports in Colorado. Sitting pretty on that three stocks. And, and that up smash is going to take it. Now, all of a sudden, it's three stocks to five. Looking really rough here for Switch. I'm really not seeing the synergy of this, uh, this team here. You see Gay and JFK working so well yeah. together, but Beg and Ashura, it just looks like they're trying to play singles with lots of people. Yeah. Ooh, nice up air to call that. JFK's follow is really good today. Oh, there we go. But finally, at 170%, Gay going to lose his first stop. He really made that one count. Ooh, the up and smash. Goes Unfortunate JFK. team kill. If Ashura and Beg can just hold it out and play smart, take this game, that's going to put them in a nice position. Oh, the forward smash called the roll. Gay's been really on top of those today. Good reads. He's hitting a lot of those forward smashes on these rolls. Oh, and that'll and do that'll it. That'll do it. Yeah. Nice setup. The combo there. up, moving together to work together. Yeah, the THC boys are really going to have to figure out what they want to do here. Resetting the bracket's a best of five, yes? Yes. Okay. So they have to win three games, yep. and then another three games. And then another, yep. And they're looking pretty good right now, up two games in this first set. I don't know, I mean, th this is looking really rough for THC. Yeah. Uh, personally, I think I think one of the problems they're going to have here is that I don't think that Eshira can really put up that good of a fight against Sonic or Yoshi. I don't think he can really box with those characters. I think that, yes, his recovery makes him a little bit better, but I don't think Falco's honestly that good overall. That said though, Eshira, his Falco is disgusting. He does some really good stuff. How I do particularly you... like his offstage game with Falco. I think his offstage game is phenomenal. How do you feel about Veg going DDD here? I think it's better. I I, I, I mean, this is this is his staple character that he's been playing mostly throughout this doubles tournament. And that's what's gotten them into grand finals on winner's side. Now there was one game, I think, it was just one game where I saw the Mario come out besides mm -hmm. the one we just saw. And it worked out okay. But, but not, not but like not this. phenomenally, right? So, okay. so I think they need to. Uh, ooh, the game and watch. Interesting. Custom game and watch. Okay, here we go. Game and watch with Falco. I don't. You're don't not know. feeling it. I'm not feeling it. Yeah, I can see on your face. You're really not. I. Whenever I've done doubles, and I'm definitely nowhere near these this level of double play. But game and watch just doesn't. He's awkward. And that might play into their strengths, but... Well, I think, here's the thing, I think he hits like a truck, he juggles very well, um, but, and, and obviously there are certain strategies surrounding him that are incredibly strong, you know, we talked about Sheik, yeah. Sheik Game & Watch, and Villager Game & Watch with Customs on, Ness Game & Watch, yada yada, all very, very strong. It, so. And it, what it looks like the strategy right now is, is just one of them pick a person in focus, rather than the trying to double team. Yeah, yeah. I, th I think what they uh, they should keep that strategy up because it's working. Yeah, and especially if they start with Eshra and they finish with Veg in terms of the moves they use, Veg is gonna hit hard with Game Watch. Eshra is gonna hit fast and yeah. set it up, and Game Watch will hit hard. 
That's the thing about Falco, though. He's not that fast. Really great up smash, though, from Red. And another great up smash to cover the anti-air. Of course, that up smash does have a bunch of armor on it. Cannot be hit out of it in a long time. Yeah, sure, they're gonna make it back. I really like the choice, though, from the game to abandon uh, the edge guard and go for the follow-up instead. Gets Let's a see if they can capitalize. Yeah. Almost hits the up. Wow, well, it's a one, unfortunately. Oh, the pummels, yeah. Eshiro wisely just gets out of there, doesn't try anything fancy. JFK capitalizing in the air. There goes Mr. Game Watch. Oh no, the team kill! Not quite, though. It did put him in a precarious position, though. And, uh, Veg wisely coming in and punishing to take the stock. Now so Eshiro sitting pretty on that first stock. For the first time... Ooh, there it goes. And as I was about to say, for the first time, THC takes the lead here, but... They, they, I mean, percentage-wise, they definitely they're are. They're still in the lead, yeah. But this could swing back at any moment. Or get deeper into their favor. Just one mess up, yeah. and Ooh, there's the up air, not quite. Yeah. Oh, he doesn't get the follow-up. If he had a little bit more awareness there, he probably could have killed JFK. There Kills him go. on the anti-air anyway. JFK not respecting the armor of the up smash. Once again, not respecting the armor of the up smash. He cannot approach that from the air very consistently. Oh, <laughs> Hammer's his own teammate. It's a two. Nice forwarder. Oh, the up smash. That was so good from Kay. Evens up the stock count there at high percents. High enough for the game and watch, that's for sure. Some hype going on in the background for some squad action. You're going to see that coming up next after Grand Finals. Shura gets the outsmash on him. Punish. That was a really good sequence from him. He just took away Gay's options one by one and then punished what was left. Really strong play there from Shura. There we go. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. Oh, the forward air. Ah, that'll do it. Here we go. Last stock situation. Pretty close here. Now we're going to play this out. See. Nice back air from Eshera. Okay, come back on. Ooh, the chair. Oh, this is so precarious here. This is a close one. This is going to come right yeah. down to the wire. Keep in mind, though, that uh, this is only the first set. Of two, if you Ooh, the up smash will take it. Now here we go. Now here it's we a go. Let's see. This is huge. And JFK needs to stay alive here yeah. so they can work their team. And Eshera pull this out. It's going to be really tough. That up throw. But it doesn't work. Wait a minute. Ooh, calls it with the down air. Uh oh. Uh oh. So high up there. That was a little bit of a preemptive up smash there from Eshera. And then the panic. There it is. Yeah. He panicked just a little bit and then got punished for it. And that'll do it. So, so here YF we go. The, the bracket. Yeah. Yep. And now we have another best of five. Let's see how it will go.